award-winning Las Vegas headliners will pay tribute to the iconic music that continues to make Las Vegas the entertainment capital of the world at Concert for the Critters. The show is a benefit for the Nevada SPCA. Joining us now are headliner Peter Pavone and executive director of the NSPCA, Lori Heeren. Good morning. Good, Good morning. morning. We were just talking about having Lori back in without the pups today. Well, she brought a dog of <laughs> other sorts. <laughs> <laughs> well, Peter, tell us all about what this event entails. Well, you know, when I was putting together a new show and I said, well, why don't, actually, if I back up, last year I had experienced stage four lymphoma. I went through chemotherapy. Now I'm completely healthy. Oh, wow. So I decided to recommit my entertainment career to uh, benefiting charities. Yeah. So I started with the first one last month, and this is the second one, Lori's NSPCA. And, uh, you know, so it gives me motivation, and uh, I can feel, you know, real good about doing what I do. So we put together a new show. It's going to celebrate the iconic soundtrack of Las Vegas, old and new, with a twist, different sound. I've got all new arrangements, a nine-piece orchestra and uh, great headliners, you know, Ronnie Rose, uh, Kelly Vaughn, uh, Chase Brown, and we're going to have a party. It's going to be uh, at the uh, Notoriety, you know, and uh, uh, we're going we're gonna to have fun. It, it sounds exciting. Sounds, sounds very razzle-dazzling, so it matches the jacket y you wore today. I I'm, love it. I'm getting in touch with my inner <laughs> Liberace hey, you're today. You're ready to go already. <laughs> so why are donations so important for the NSPCA, Lori? Well, Jessica, Nevada SBCA relies entirely on donations from the community, and we receive no um, funding from the government. So events like this that Peter has put together are really vital for us to continue our good work to shelter and provide care and medical care for almost 3,000 homeless pets every year. So we're just really grateful for this amazing event and love working with an event, especially one that represents our community so well with the Las Vegas theme. Yeah, and can you elaborate a little bit more on with an event like this, where those donations go to specifically to help with what you're doing? Absolutely, you know, with the rising prices right now with the economy, I mean, it costs us almost $900 to, um, for everything that's included to bring animals into our shelter, to provide them the medical care. A lot of the animals that come in need uh, extensive medical care. And then, of course, everything else that's involved with um, our, our staff, our full-time staff, and then finding them, of course, loving new homes. So it's expensive to be able to take in these animals from owners or other shelters and then find them the right home. And again, we're just really grateful for this opportunity um, and especially an opportunity that's so fun. Yeah, and Peter, I mean, when you were putting all this together, what made you decide on doing this to help fundraise for the NSPCA? Well, you know, it's all about, life is all about who you know and connections and so forth. And I met Lori um, through a mutual friend. And I said, well, and I'm also an animal person. I became a horse whisperer back in Virginia. I became, you know, riding horses and so forth. And it spreads out to other animals too. Once you have an affinity and a connection to one type of animal, it spreads. So uh, every time I see the pictures of the poor little critters on uh, the Facebook or whatever, it just breaks my heart. So I wanted to do something and uh, in fact, we wanted to offer a 20% discount to your viewers if they put in the uh, code donor, they can get 20% off wow. when they buy tickets. Great, 20% off if you use the keyword donor. Just wanted to repeat that for our viewers yeah. out there. Now, earlier you mentioned there's going to be an orchestra. You did mention some other special guests that are going to join you on stage. How did how did you decide, hey, we're, I mean, I, I figured it was kind of like we're going out with a bang and putting together a whole orchestra for this. Well, I've been in performing arts since I was 12. And I came here in 2011 when I was cast as Frank Sinatra in the Rat Pack and Dean Martin and Johnny Cash and George Strait. And you might have seen my Abraham Lincoln commercials on television. Yeah. <laughs> so I've been a chameleon and a performer. And my singing voice is my key. So I'm very experienced that music and performing and, and producing. So uh, it was kind of easy to do that and exciting. I've worked with some great arrangers, Gary Anderson, Gene White. I've got an all-star lineup of musicians. Uh, we're going to be at the uh, showroom over at Notoriety uh, and uh, 
just can't wait to hit the stage. It sounds super exciting. We can't wait for this as well. Thank you both so much for joining us this morning. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Don't miss a concert for the Critters. It's happening at Notoriety on Sunday, October 6th at 3 p.m. Tickets start at $25 and can be ordered online.